In your presence, there is anointing, and the Spirit moves around me. In your presence, the anointing breaks the yoke. <clears throat> when I come into your presence, I'm so happy. When I come into your presence, I'm so glad. In your presence, there is anointing, and the Spirit moves around me. In your presence, the anointing breaks the yoke. He's the Lord, He's the Lord. He's the Lord. He has risen from the dead. He's the Lord. Every knee shall bow and every tongue confess that Jesus Christ is the Lord. Glory to Jesus. This morning, we are going to look <clears throat> at the scripture. We're going to derive our prayer from the scriptures, from the book of Psalms. Glory to God. Psalms chapter 3. This is our third day. Of our 150 days of fasting. And I'm encouraging you to make sure that you observe this. Because the Lord promised to take away the hard things. Those things that looks very hard. Glory to God. Amen. That looks impossible. God is going to make it possible. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And God wants you to enjoy this fasting as we go on. Glory to God. So today is our third day of fasting and prayer. And the Lord say use Psalm 1 to 150 as we go along. So today we are going to pray with Psalms chapter 3. And I encourage you, even after this introduction and prayer, continue for the whole day. Don't, don't give up. Remember, our fasting ends by 3 o'clock. Glory to God. Glory to God. And also, I would like you to invite people. <clears throat> Tell people to come on. Tell people to come on. Regardless of what they are going through. Glory to Jesus. Hallelujah. Invite everyone that you know. Tell the person to come on. It's prayer breakfast. We do it every morning. Glory to Jesus. Apart from Sunday... We do it every morning. So this morning, <clears throat> we're going to read from verse 1. And before we read, I also want you to download Send Me Radio. It is very important. Send Me Radio is an amazing radio station. Online radio station. You can... Download it anywhere in the world. Anywhere. If you're in the UK, those that are calling from United Kingdom, those that are calling from Indonesia, those that are calling from those that are calling from um, Africa, Kenya, other places. I want you to encourage everyone. Those that are calling from China, those that log in, I want you to Tell everyone within your domain to download Send Me Radio. It's so amazing. It's so wonderful. Glory to God. Go to App Store if you use iPhone or Android if you're using 
Go to um, Google Store if you're using Android. Sorry. So I want you to go ahead with me to Psalms chapter 3 verse 1. The Bible says, Lord, how are they increased that troubled me? Many are they that rise up against me. <clears throat> Many they be which say of my soul, there is no help for him in God. But thou, O Lord, art a shield for me, my glory, and the lifter up of my head. I cried unto the Lord with my voice, and he heard me out of his holy hill. I laid me down and slept. <clears throat> I awaked, for the Lord sustained me. I will not be afraid of ten thousands of people that have set themselves against me round about. Arise, O Lord, save me, O my God, for thou hast smitten all my enemies upon the cheekbone, and thou hast broken the teeth of the ungodly. Salvation belongeth unto the Lord. Thy blessing is upon thy people. Glory to God. The blessings of God is upon his people. No wonder why the enemy is increasing. Glory to God. I want you to know that when God, I explained over and over, that blessing is not just a material things. Of course, it can show up as material things. You know, when you buy a house, you say, the Lord has blessed me with a house. When you buy a car, you say, the Lord has blessed me with a car. Whether you get it as a gift or you buy it with your money, you say, God has blessed me. God has blessed me with children. God has blessed me with this, with that. But hey, what blessing actually means is an empowerment. God empowers you to produce. Empowers you to be fruitful. And when that empowerment comes, it does not come without the jealousy and envy of the enemy. The Bible says, how are they increased? That trouble me. So there are trouble all on every side. Anywhere you turn. Somebody once asked me, when is this fight going to end? I said it will not end. It will only end when you leave this world. As long as you're here, there are contentions. Always. Fight. From the ones you can see and the ones you cannot see. The enemies that we know is fewer than the enemies we don't know. Glory to God. You don't have to do anything to become an enemy. You just have to be a human being. You just have to side with God. Because you are going against the tide. Of course, you will become an opposition. We are opposite of worldly system. Remember, we are operating from a different realm and system. Where you will be slapped and you will turn the other cheek. Glory to God. Where somebody will hit you and you will enjoy it. Where others will be enjoying alcohol and you refuse because of what you believe. So, practically, you are going against the tide of the worldly system of how Satan, the God of this world, has set up the world to be flowing, flowing into hell. Glory to God. But now you are going against the tide 
That is number one reason why the enemy has increased that troubles you. Then you come into the congregation of God. In that congregation, everyone is allowed. <clears throat> of course, when somebody comes into the church, you don't say, this one is from Satan or is from God. But the Bible says, by their own fruit, you shall know them. That's why we, we examine and test every spirit. The scripture says, test every spirit. And know if it was of God. So the spirit that comes from God. Believe that Jesus Christ came in the flesh. It's a simple test. That what Jesus said, ask you to do. He has done it. So he becomes the author and the finisher of our faith. I want you to understand why the enemy has increased? So do not go about say, I don't have no enemy. No, there are bunches of them. There are many of them all around. And that's why we are praying this morning. That God himself, who says that one shall chase 1,000. But two shall chase 10,000. When you begin to multiply and do the mathematics, I want to explain it to you. He said, two shall chase 10,000. So there is a God in the midst of the two chasing 8,000. Because if one shall chase one, two is supposed to chase 2,000. But he said, where two or three people are gathered, I am in their midst. So when you people agree together, demons are on the flight. Glory to God. Hallelujah. So that's why we need agreement. That's why we need unism. Faith. We need to be united. We need to agree together. Glory to God. When we don't agree together, the enemy constantly increases. And you become the anger. You become the jealousy. You become the envy of the enemy. They will continuously attack. When you learn, when you run as one bunch, you will be attacked and they will get hold of you easily. Glory to God. Many are they that rise against me. Many there be which say of my soul, there is no help for him in God. People say it. They will look at someone and they will look around the person and they will conclude that this one has no help. Glory to God. Amen. He has no mother. He has no father. He has no family. He has no body. I can easily pick him up. I can easily deal with her anyhow. She has no mother. She has no father. She has no body. So I'm going to deal with her anyhow I like. But hey, I want you to understand this morning. That God is her father. Amen. He said, when your mother and your father reject you, God will take you. Glory to God. Amen. I want you to know, if you feel you have nobody, there is a God who is the father, not only of persons, who have no mother, no care of the father, but the father of all spirits. Oh my God. Shomali Kabranata. Get Portalibo. My God is the father of all spirits. There is a help for you this morning in the name of Jesus Christ. So we're going to pray. And our number one prayer is a prayer of agreement. Ask the Lord that in your family you will become unified. Let your family unified. 
whatever the enemy has brought in the midst of you people that scattered everybody abroad, whichever horn that dumbled into your family and scatter everyone must come together this morning and that horn must be broken that powers must be destroyed in the name of jesus christ so we're gonna pray and number two is that our enemy that has been increasing we begin to reduce from today in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. We will reduce the powers of the enemy. We will crumble it. We will dismantle it. And we will put them to fright. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Why? Because God has become our shield. Our glory. And the lifter up of our head. Hallelujah. Amen. Every head that is down this morning... God is lifting you up. Whatever has kept your head down, whether you have not been able to pay your bills, whether you have been contemplating, contemplating about your sickness, I want you to know whether you have been contemplating of your sickness and Wondering what is going to happen to you. And trying to figure out where, how, help is going to come. I don't care about that sickness. The Lord says he will lift up your head. Amen. Your head is going to be lifted this morning in the name of Jesus Christ. So let us pray. Open your mouth this morning. And begin to ask God to unify your family. That's the first thing. Unify our families. Unify my children. Somebody listening to me right now. You need unity. Let your family unify. When they unify, it will be glorious. In the name of Jesus Christ. Let peace take over. Right now, yes, open your mouth. Say, Lord, all my children shall unify. We shall be a unified family. Unity, peace, in the name of Jesus Christ. Yes, Lord, in the precious name of Jesus Christ. We're going to shout Holy Ghost fire seven times and the blood of Jesus seven times. And you're going to begin to pray and demand that the enemy of your soul will begin to reduce from today. No more increase. No more addition. Minus. We are going to deplete their powers. We are going to ensure that all their gatherings are scattered. We're going to rain fire in their camps, wherever they are, whatever they are setting up against you, whether from talisman to voodoo to witchcraft to omen, whatever they call it, the power of God is going to scatter them this morning in the name of Jesus Christ. You will be free from every satanic ordinances. Decree and pray. Holy Ghost fire. 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 Holy Ghost fire in Jesus' mighty name. The blood of Jesus Christ. 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 The precious blood of Jesus Christ. Oh God, arise. Let your enemies be scattered. Do not keep silence. Power. Yes, Lord. We begin to scatter every powers of hell. Every talisman, every voodoo, whichever voodoo they have set against your life, whichever voodoo they have set to terminate your life, we release the fire this morning. We command that the power of God, we go to every nooks and cranny, we go to every spiritual zone. 
that is holding you a transformer. We release the fire. 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 Manto koporuko chopakaya. Rima sakolo botekia. Ei masande libokota. As a parimate. I release you right now. I command that the enemies will fall on their face. We release the fire. We release the fire to go into every evil altar. Every evil altar where your name is being called. Every evil altar where your pictures are being handed. Oh, Palika Barabo. Every evil altar where your son's picture has been hung. Every evil altar where your daughter's picture has been hanged, we release the fire. We release the fire. I set you free this morning by the power in the name of Jesus. The evil priest in Chiba, we release the fire. 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 I release the fire. I release the fire. In the name of Jesus Christ, be free. Be free right now. Yes. No more entanglement with the powers of Satan. We release you. We release your freedom. By the Mosaic and Basalibo Kotar. Yes, Lord. Regardless of who is attacking you, whether it's your husband attacking you, or your wife attacking you, or your siblings, or your relatives, or your co whichever place, whichever place is, is, is coming from, the power of God has proceeded. And that power must be broken this morning in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. There is somebody on this line whose son has been running in confusion. Your son is confused. Sometimes it appears as if he's getting mad. The power of God is setting him free. Now, from this morning, you shall see a new page of your son. Glory to God. Glory to God. There is a healing that is coming in his soul, that is coming in his brain, setting him free. Yes, 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 yes. In the name of Jesus Christ. Glory to God. Penonta kiabo. Varuma senkati katsubrinatia. There is someone who always gets sick. You'll be okay. But once you get into the office, you start feeling weird. You start feeling sick. You, you, you don't get yourself. And you wonder what is going on. That power is being broken this morning. And you shall be free. In the name of Jesus Christ. Yes. 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 You are free in the name of Jesus Christ. Glory to God. Panikam posalata. Vate horobo can say. Zatelikan korobo son tarikabai. Yes, Lord. The Lord is setting you free right now. No more. As they enter into that, the person that is organizing it, do it one more time, it will backfire on her. Glory to God. You see, when you go to work and everybody's on suit and a very pretty dress, you think we are all operating on the same level. No. There are some witches who are head of departments. There are some people who look for heads to pay their tributes. And your head shall not be that head. In the name of Jesus Christ. Yes, you will escape. That enemy must bow in the name of Jesus Christ. You are free. You are free. No one 
shall sacrifice your head. Your head is too big to be sacrificed. Yes. Yes. The Bible said the world is dark. Every dark powers. Every dark powers. Attacking your soul. He said our enemies has increased. But this morning is being reduced. Amen. Glory to God. There is someone listening to me right now. Somebody is going to resign from your office unannounced. He will stop coming. After this, I want you, don't stop. Don't, don't stop fasting. But Because by the time we finish this, many people will quit. From offices where you work because of conniving and group of witchcraft, you think you're just fighting normal. No, I want you to pray this morning again that God will lift up your head. Ask the Lord, lift up my head, the lifter of my head, lift up my head. Glory to God. Huh. Anything that I put down your head. God has risen to lift up your head this morning. Your head shall not be bowed in shame from this day. God is going to lift up your head in the name of Jesus. Open your mouth, decree this morning. Oh Lord, lift up my head. Lift the head of my family. Lift the head of my children. Lift the head of my family. Lift the head of my children. Lift the head of my family. Lift the head of my wife. In the name of Jesus Christ, lift our heads, 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 O oh Lord, lift our heads in the name of Jesus Christ, the lifter of my head, lift my head, O oh Lord, lift my head, O oh Lord. Lift my head, O oh Lord. Lift my head, O oh Lord. In the name of Jesus Christ. Dai kaporo no tenkasia botala. Bari masokoro botankika solia. Ema sankaraba. Dali bakuru. Asiabato luderi masantai. Yes, Lord. In the precious name of Jesus Christ. Glory to God. We give you praise. We give you praise. Lift up your hands wherever you are. And say to God, I lift your name higher. 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 I lift your name higher, Jesus. I lift your name higher. 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 Just wave your hand, wave your hand, and say to God, I love you, Lord. I give you praise for answering my prayer this morning, for lifting me up this morning, for lifting my head up. I give you glory for destroying my enemies, to reducing them in the name of Jesus. I give you glory. I give you praise for healing the sick in the name of Jesus Christ. Put your right hand on your head. If you're hearing me right now, Put your right hand on your head and I'm going to pray for everyone sick, regardless of your sickness. Everyone weak, regardless of your weakness. The power of God is going to touch you right now and set you on fire. <laughs> and set you with an enormous energy, enormous strength in the name of Jesus. Amen. Glory to God. In the name of Jesus, 
I decree this morning, be healed. Every sickness under the sound of my voice, receive healing now from the crown of your head to the sole of your feet in the name of Jesus. Be free. Be free. Be healed. And I pray that as you move around this morning, no accident, no gunman will attack you, will touch you. I cover you with the blood of Jesus Christ. I cover your family. I cover your children. Thank you, Lord. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Amen. Amen.